Uh, Dan Olds doing a little bit more coverage for the register uh, down here at uh, Silicon Mechanics uh, with Art Man. Welcome. So, what do you guys do? So, Silicon Mechanics. Uh, actually, this is our 10-year anniversary. Really? So we're well, celebrating that. Thank you. Thank I just you. had a birthday too. Oh, well, so, we all do eventually. I didn't but hear no. anything from you guys, but oh, okay. Sorry, sorry. I forgot the cards in the mail. Okay. Uh, we've been again 10-year anniversary. We're a rack mount server storage and HPC integrator. Mm -hmm. uh, what we're really good at doing is we, we make the whole process easy. We mm -hmm. try from the beginning. If somebody came to our website, we were the first company ever to put the power calculator right into a configurator, oh, really? which is surprising. I mean, That's I've been around a long yeah. time, you can tell yeah. by the gray hair, yeah. and the tier ones don't even do that. No. Uh, for us, you go to there, you do a configuration, and you get the power calculations, the, the volts, the amps, the BTUs. So we've tried to make it easier. Most, yeah, most of our customers are in the open source world. So those are the kinds of things, that, the tools that they've always wanted. Yeah. So because of that, the configurator is easy to use. It gives lots of different options. Our website itself has over 40 different configurations. Okay. So compared to some of the other companies, you know, the t always people ask us, how are we compared to the, the other companies, the tier ones? Yeah. And the answer is, we offer a lot more. A lot more you know, configurability and customization a, for the size of customer that you're dealing with. The correct. Client, you know. They're not buying an entire data center worth at a time. Uh, even though we have com we have filled data centers for companies. Yeah. So a company like Second Life, uh, if people are familiar with Linden oh, Lab. You guys do them? That we've done thousands and thousands that's of servers fair, for them. That's a fair infrastructure so, we have together yeah. there. But then we do small clusters. We're happy to do everything from say an eight hundred dollar web server mm -hmm. to a say a um, mid range. Works group, work group, or a departmental cluster. I should have talked to you guys about my personal supercomputer I'm buying. I'm doing. Sure. Okay. I'd be happy to still talk to you about that. Well, the other great thing, and uh, first of all, you're based here in Seattle. Correct. And you guys are sponsoring the Boston University team in the student cluster competition. Yeah, yeah, we're very proud of that sponsorship. And they've done a reasonable job. They, They're doing great. First time in, they're great kids, yep. by the way, yep. too. But uh, you, they say that you guys have just been fantastic. Oh, it's been great working with them. I mean, we've BU, part of BU is a customer of ours. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've been working with them on GPU computing yeah. for several years and now. And their system up there has everything but a garage door opener. Right, I know. Into it. Well, that's actually it does. We just, we, we, they logos. can't use it. Oh, really? They can't okay. use the garage door opener because okay. it'll pull more power. And a, a microwave circuit board is yeah. in there somewhere. <laughs> but it's it's nice, and they've got a lot out of it, especially mm -hmm. for being a first-time competitor. Right. They're well, doing well. Well, what was nice is they approached us about trying to sponsor them, and uh -huh. it was not something we'd ever done before. Sure. So we, we scratched our heads and figured, okay, you know, what do we're, we need to do? What do we need to do? And we approached AMD, and AMD quickly jumped on board and said they'd get us the latest and greatest 16 core processors. Which they have. Yep. So we had those before anybody else had them. Yep. We had NVIDIA come up with M2090 GPUs. You got the high end GPUs. Supermicro helped kick in the systems to some extent, and the, yep. cha you know, the chassis and motherboards. Yep. Kingston with SSDs and memory, Seagate with disk drives. So all our partners chipped in, and we did as well. And it wasn't a big. It wasn't as hard as you thought. I would hope. No, actually, it was. It was or easier to get the equipment. Or anything like right. That. So it's been great. And then the other thing it allowed us to do, and I don't know if you've heard about this, is we help with our partners sponsor a, a cluster, a research cluster grant. Oh, so really? we're actually going to award that cluster to an institution, some academic Excellent. institution in the United States or Canada. We've launched it here at SC11. Uh -huh. They um, have until November, excuse me, February 15th to submit application. So we're taking proposals now. Okay. And we're going to award that cluster to an institution for their use. Is that on your website? It's on our website. Okay, we I'll have get a cards link about it here as well. Then. Yeah. But no, that's a, that's a great, I didn't hear about that. No, it's something, we've, it's something we've been toying around for years trying to figure out could we ever do something like this. Yeah. And it's a way of saying thank you to the education space and giving something back. And we know. Getting a grant is not easy. Yeah. You know, when you're applying for NSF no. or NIH, it's less than 10%. Yeah. Now, this is a way to just say thank you and providing and something that may be an impetus for somebody's research. And that's a fair amount of computer power. It's, it's quite a bit, I mean, yes. Well, they could be well over the 26 amps. They could double oh, that. Oh, they up actually they found out if they run everything full bar, or it's 40 amps. There you go. So they, they had to cut back on a few things. That's okay. It's better <laughs> to have too much than too little. Right. So, right. Um, what did you, you get out of the sponsorship of the team? So we're just it's right now it's the camaraderie. I mean, I've gotten to know great. these guys more. I was back in Boston a few weeks ago, yeah. so I got to meet them for the first time. 
even though I know the, 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 yeah. uh, the advisor, Dan Kamalik. He's a great guy. Yep. Uh, now I got to meet the students, and I've been going up there every day and saying hi and making sure they're okay. And, uh, isn't that fun? And would, yeah. you get, would you do it again? Oh, definitely. Yeah. I, mean, I really want to see more schools. We didn't get into this, in this to like, you know, to win, even yeah. though it'd be sort of nice to to win. But uh, we'll see what happens. They're, they're having a great time, no matter what they do. Yeah, and they're, they're learning. They're learn oh, they're learning a lot. Yeah. these are kids Definitely. that haven't done this, and they're really learning a lot. Right, and they've come a long way. It's it's just great to watch them. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna go up and shoot some more video of them oh, later good, on good. too. But hey, thank you very much, Art. Oh, you're welcome. And I will uh, get a link in uh, to your grant. Uh, competition. That's, that's Perfect. a great Thank you very much. Thank you. Good. Thank Talk you. Talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.